And we're live. Cool. So, not sure if the audio is going to work. Not sure if the stream's going to work, but hey. stream's going to work, but hey. Going to be trying. So. Going to be trying. So. I think we might be getting some double audio soon. This is going fantastic. Double audio soon. This is going fantastic. All right. Anyways, we're gonna be doing some art today. It's gonna be uh, some gesture drawing I was supposed to finish a while ago, but uh, <coughs> you know, I'm new to dr gesture drawing, not an expert, and I have troubles with the controls. I have learned controls from Blender. Clip Studio is still very new to me. Drawing is in general as well. But, oh, okay. That's cool. That is cool. And I am going to be talking about random stuff and have periods of silence, and that's going to be all great. Fantastic. Okay. It's going to be... Oh. <coughs> See how it goes. Talking about politics. Let's get to drawing. Okay, so <clears throat> learning that uh, when we're drawing, gesture drawing, it's supposed to be all about line economy or something like that. Fewer lines, better, but it has to be expressive lines, not just lines that are just there for the sake of it. Not easy. Not easy at all. I'm on my last of, of series of 50, 45 of which I didn't stream. Today is just getting them done. And then doing some goofy drawings. <coughs> then maybe tomorrow we'll be working on some comics, which has taken me a while. Been on the fence. Writer, artist, block, whatever it is. But that's an awesome circle. I wonder how freaky this looks. Aha, uh -huh. you guys can't see. For sure. Depending on the resolution. If you hear background noise, uh, think of it as atmospheric. <coughs> this is gonna be a fantastic show. Nothing, nothing can ever go wrong. I can guarantee it. This is gonna be flawless. I can already see that I'm clipping the mic a little bit. That's okay. Helps me relax knowing that I've clipped the mic at least once. Let's continue. Is this this is the the lady's face. Uh, the spine goes. If we're looking that way, the spine goes. Zoop. Nope. The spine goes. Zunk. 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 Nope. That uh, looks like a messed up paper clip. Oh no, wait, it looks like Pac-Man. looks like a fish. We drawing fishes now. Drawing fishes. This is a stream. I gotta get this done. This is not a commission, but I gotta get it done. Fish yourself mouth like that? Anyways. Spine goes... Nope. So if we're curving it, right? It says... Nope, nope. I had to check my drawings, so. <clears throat> if the spine goes like this, that means the, the neck goes like that. Then we have this lumbar down here. And yeah, there we go. That's the, okay, so if we're looking at this character, or this 
reference its model and see that the neck goes like that I don't really care about it looking pretty it's all about function gotta go around the booty yep <coughs> The first is uh, the head, obviously. Head is umero numero. You know, I should work on my Spanish. I am, as you can tell, with a heavy accent, not of Latin or Spanish descent, or well versed in the lingo. Here's the pelvis area. Yeah, nope. That went the wrong way. It should be like this. It should be like this. And then we will have something like that. So we can do that. Chopped off her legs. That's great. Let's rework it. Let's rework it, folks. Let's rework it. So if I were to draw her like this, like that, hip, that's most of the thigh, we have the rest of the thigh, we have her legs, I mean her feet, <coughs> some pelvis work here be her groin and that's uh, there we go all right all right folks we got that we got that going then we got the back leg back leg goes like that and uh, this is her foot cool we got her arms so arm left arm pretty bad at this. I prefer getting it done over not doing it. <clears throat> so I cut off part of her arm, unfortunately. And then uh, there's, there's her hand. Yep, okay. Cross contours. All right. What? All right. All right. What? Got that going on, and bam. <coughs> the first one down, and we have a fish. What you said? What? Gonna save my work before I break it. I'm surprised you still had six. And we have some amazing background noise from our studio audience. Awesome. Alright. No, I didn't. Our studio oh, audience is quite lively. They are, in fact, hired professionals from the Blue Maybe Man group. I don't know. I think I found, like, a Stunning. I know. Nothing but the best for this stream. Nothing but the best. <clears throat> and you too can be a part of this live studio audience. With 10 easy payments of messing up my application, but that's okay. Okay. Next one. I have a real big problem with drawing heads. Uh, as you can tell from my gestures, the proportions are whack. I'm going to be working on those. Her eyes are like that. Okay, I don't know cool. if I freaking know how back or backdash either one of those things. Probably how long. That's probably and long. there's someone combating another guy that's in a street right toe right. fighter match in the audience. Okay. We have some active PC cabinets. That's wonderful. And let's see, her spine is kind of twisted in this one because she's turning back. Hopefully you can see that. But
but then her lumbar and her um, is it shoulder blades, you know, her the main spine, pretty much the same, running all the way down to her buttocks. Uh, yep, those booty shorts are doing good. Well used. Anyways, stop harassing the model, who is a picture. No feelings. Yep. Okay. Anyways, uh, so now we got the spine. So we do the head, the spine, the pelvis. I'm not sure how to really draw the pelvis well. Justice, at least. Uh, no, not anime justice in this case, but you know, more power to you. And yep, that is too short of a booty. Gotta figure this out. Yeah, good enough. Uh, hopefully, y'all can imagine this. So her, oh my God, stupid her thigh goes gone. like that. Oh, nope. Not like that. And her leg got cut off again. Congratulations, sir. Uh, let's see here. Oh, she is a... Uh, ooh. Those proportions are off. Basically, the idea is that head, bottom of the pelvis should be the same as top of the pelvis to the but that's obviously not correct so let us fix that let us fix that let's keep that in mind head to bot of pelvis let's use some math notation is the same as the top of pelvis. Maybe it would have been nice if I drew them proportionately, huh? Two feet. No. Eh. <laughs> huh? Okay, dokey. Same. Equal. In this case, this is not equal, so let's fix that. <clears throat> so, let's see here. If we care about proportions, right? It should be four heads. If we're doing eight heads, right? Eight heads. So eight heads would mean one, two, three, four, right? So this would be the bottom this would be the middle of the body. As we can see, that is not the case. So, let me... There we go. <clears throat> if we care to do the rest of the measurements. Right. It should be eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'm going to fudge this one. It doesn't have to be exact, but roughly. So if we care about proportions, right? You see what I'm saying is that the height from here to here should be the same as here to here. There's one, two, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. As you can see, I am not a mathematician. Neither can I measure. Okay, so <clears throat> if we were to draw the pelvis here, right? Somewhere in the middle oh, here. Yeah, I tried to draw a circle with the first fireball. So if this is the top of the pelvis, this is the bottom of the pelvis, right? Then we should be able to get that height. Ghosting. 
Wow, that is really low. I should probably use my markers. Nope, that is still way low. Now that is a weird shape. Okay, whatever. <coughs> Moving on. This is all about entertainment and getting it working. Forum over function is not the way of this show. I almost said it wrong. Okay. So it's function over form. Function must work with form. That is art. Or where art meets engineering. Engineering meets art. So. Then we got this here. This here. Okay, good. Now, the thing here is that leg, her left leg, or her right leg, is pretty much going straight down foot is raised off the ground slightly. Hopefully y'all can see that. Her other one is going to the side. <coughs> A little dainty look. The, we got the pelvis, we got the legs, now the fifth part, the arms. This is based on uh, Michael Hampton's stuff, so... so this one's a little bit challenging because her body's twisted, so... <coughs> I got a little bit of her stuff. So we got one arm. It goes down to the bottom of the pelvis, and then we get a little bit like that. The other hand comes around, wraps around her body, and it's like that. Basically, now we do the cross contours. Got that, got that, got this, got this. Hopefully, that helps illustrate. If not, We'll slowly improve and figure this out. Slowly, but surely. My name's not sure. That's her spine, not her arm. This is her arm, not her spine. <coughs> okay, cool. Got another one down. Oops, oops, don't want to move that one. Okay, that was number two. Okie dokie. Now number three. And these models and references are courtesy of Crokey Cafe. Uh, I am just a freelance student, illustrator, graphic designer, so they have been a very useful resource, so check them out on onairvideo.com. You have no doubt I've seen them around the reference circles. <coughs> very nice people from, I believe, White, Whitehaven. Definitely not White Castle, I don't think. Whitehaven, Florida. <clears throat> Swig of some water. Third one. Let's go. Team strategy. Head. Spine. Pelvis. Legs. Arms. Proportions. But proportions should go first, right? Let's draw her head. You do a double. Yeah. Good enough. Yep, the audience wants some grass. I do hear that. 
Why do you want? Why do you want grass, studio audience? Because uh, it's nice. Because it's nice, folks. You heard it here first. Grass is nice until it's allergy season, in which case you die. But the audience loves their grass. They also like their astroturf, so <clears throat> there is that. So in this case, her spine's pretty much straight down. It's a little bit curved, but it's not that significant flying economy and such. Her body is facing us. Which is interesting. Oh, let's see this real. If this was a hers. Three should be about. <clears throat> this should be her belly button here. No, it should be down here. Humans are really great at adapting. It's fantastic. And as you can see, my voice is already going out. So this is going to be a fantastic show. It's only been like, what, a million minutes? Off the hook. Wow, the audience really did not like my performance. They're already booing me. I love that. Feeds my ego. Puts me back in my place. I love that. I love that guy. He hates me. I love him. We're not trying to draw the body. We're trying to draw the lines that make up the body. Ooh, that was awesome. So I'm still not very well versed oh in the fort shortening techniques, so uh there's like some weird like interactions where it goes through the fire bolt. Like it hits the first time. And we noticed and the the weight bearing leg as it's yeah. referred to by my oh, yeah, friends. So Over at Bargon Space Man. Check him out. He's a streamer. And um, so now we got the legs. She got some freaking uh, polar bear feet. That's okay. We don't. It's all about the gesture. We're trying to capture the essence of the model, the human figure. Remember that, folks. The essence. Of the human figure. This model would be laughing at me right now. If she saw the creation that I was able to extract from my fingertips. Of course she is not viewing this. She got better things to do. Like model. So I appreciate her work. Appreciate the looks at on air video. Also known as Croquis Cafe. Let's do some cross contour. Cross the contour. Cross the contour. This not looking good. Okay. 
Anyways, polar bear feet lady. Moving on. <clears throat> this one's going to be slightly foreshortened. Oh, the last one's heavily foreshortened. This is going to be fun. Okay, folks. This lady this time around. Three easy payments of ma minimizing and maximizing my window. When I try to be funny, it's not funny, I've been told. I disagree, but I've always been wrong. Studio audience agrees. They're laughing at me right now. I've just muted them out. Amazing background noise filtering uh, technology we got here. And, yep, anyways, we're on four of five. And then it's free draw time, folks. Free draw, free draw. Why do I talk like this? Because I'm an extremely nervous and uh, shy person, and we're going to talk like this because I'm actually really tired. <laughs> So I can't actually see her pelvis. I can probably imagine it. She's actually what, what her body is doing right now, folks, is doing this whole spiel. She's actually on a really? chair. Her feet are propped up. Like this every one. This one, right? She on a stool okay, of hand. sorts. Nope, it doesn't work. I'm like, what's going on? She doing this whole hand thing. And she got the other hand crossing over. Right? So this one, the darkness, shows closeness to the camera. Right? So these limbs right here are close to us. Uh -huh. These ones the, as I would say, left portion of her body is far away from us. <clears throat> so in essence, what we have is this pelvis here, kind of, kind of smushed, as, but like it's wide. He's been spending ninety-five percent of the things I threw at you. I've mixed it up like multiple times. I'm like, what is going on? So if we were to draw the body, right? be more like yes okay so if we are seeing a line right mm -hmm. get bigger as it gets closer right so yeah I was trying to frame trap you a lot but you just didn't didn't get baited I smicked it up multiple times so, like, so what we can do is my head, like, cheat why is cheat. it not working I mean it worked for like the first C two times word. And, like, I don't know what the hell I'm doing, but this is the spine. This is our imaginary pelvis. Since we cannot see, we're going to use the magical artist X-ray vision. Yeah. X-ray. This is supposed to be a picture of Ray Charles. One day yet today, but it's not good. <laughs> yeah, I have a swivel. <laughs> Ray Charles. The X Ray Charles. I like that. That's right, folks. Here yeah, and now. Basic. Basic. Already roughed it down, so you have probably an idea of what you want. Actually. We're being productive here, folks. Right here and now. Mm -hmm. 
for making uh, memes of Ray Charles. I've uh, done that in a past life with my comics over at Webtoons <laughs> and Tapas. You can find me there. Yep. Only the best with my imaginary girlfriend. Why am I saying this? Because I am tired and I don't know what I'm talking about right now. I just remember the funny comic I did. It's Ray Charles. I bet I like that Ray of Sunshine. Mm. Okay. Stop. Awesome. We like somehow you created this without me thinking about it. Wait, what was that? See the audience, the audience was speaking. Did not, did not comprehend it. All right, folks, we're winding it down. So we got that. We got the cross contour. Awesome, awesome. Got it here, here, here. Yep, yeah, uh huh, yeah. X Ray Charles. Got it. Love it. Hmm. Georgia. Hit the road, Jack. And, you know, that bird on Spaceman needs to up his game. He's got to get that microphone. Or does he? Mm -hmm. Or do you like the silent treatment, folks? Mm -hmm. Check him out sometime. <clears throat> You'll be glad you did. Okay, I'm going to click off for a split second, folks. Now, it's going to minimize the window again, or it's going to make a nasty dot. Okay. Did not make a nasty dot. Ooh, look at that. Okay, I am not a fan of the undo, because it requires discipline. I have no discipline. Okay, folks, we're going to draw this lady. She's super for short. You might think I'm drawing a lot of ladies, but man, I drew a lot of men. Okay, anyways. Mm -hmm. This yeah. one. Gonna try to do it by eye. Fly by wire. Mm -hmm. Not fly by wire. What, what the hell am I talking about? We gotta fly. Yeah. Okay, so her neck is going like this this style right so we gotta, gotta draw a little bit more the definition on her face mm -hmm. about here we got that all right she's got a face she's cutie definitely a slightly older than me I'd say definitely a few few years older than me uh, but she will be the circle and a set of lines. So, see here, her spine's doing this thing right here. It's it's kind of strange because she's kind of like twisting like that. They're not just choosing some dynamic poses, folks. Dynamic poses, the D word, not the D, the D word. Dynamic. Ooh, yeah. It's like dynamite. Plus, yeah. Microphone. Wait, why can't she mess up? Wait, no, it's because the Amazon called me the so in case they kind of. So we get dynamic. Uh. Uh. Yeah. Okay. You understand. You understand, folks. Yeah. I am not a very good artist. I would not claim to be. Mm -hmm. I will claim this this right, pose as my own. Let's draw her like that. Pelvis. I cannot see it, but I can imagine it. It goes something like a bam. Okay, cool. Yeah, good luck on your stream, Ryan says. Good luck on my stream. The audience has spoken. Oh my goodness! I will appreciate that luck. 
luck is strong. The luck is strong. I will finally create the final touches. Okay, that not dynamic enough. It's gotta be whoa. Whoa. There she goes. Ooh yeah. And the weight bearing leg as it's called. Whoa. And whoa. Underneath, underneath, yep, yep, underneath. But you gotta remember, there's line weight to it too, folks. Line weight. The other arm's hidden, so I'm gonna guesstimate. It goes like that, stretches out like that. Nope, stretches out like this. Right angle, folks, right angle. Can't go wrong with a right angle. You can always go left. Funny joke, funny joke. I should get a, uh, should get some canned laughter. Canned laughter, folks. Nope, okay, cool. Cool, tough audience tonight, folks. Okay, now we do the cross contour. Folks, love this part, makes it the 3D effect. All right, all right, folks. All right, all right. As we can see it, folks, she is coming alive in front of our eyes. Ain't that right, audience? Yes. Uh, audience has spoken. You probably didn't hear it. Oh. But because our background noise elimination technology 5000 is working like a charm, folks. Audience is going wild and we're hearing nothing. Perfect. Oh, 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 there's a little, little glitch there. Mike on the engineering booth, please fix that. We're paying you something. We're not paying you nothing, Mike. <laughs> that makes it five, folks. Call it five. Five gesture drawings, this is 6, 17, 20, 20. And let's check it out, folks. We did it. In... How long have we been live, folks? I should have noticed the timer. Where is it? Thirty-eight minutes and five sketches, folks. I talk way too much. Went from this, where her arm got chopped off with a fish. Now we, uh... We got all the way to the spine, the, the equality. Quality, and she looking back at us, being like, What is wrong with your face? And then we move on to another lovely lady just doing the honky tonky dance. All right, she dancing. She dancing to the Ray, the X Ray Charles. Gotta make sure we gotta look at that X Ray pelvis right there, folks. We love that X Ray Charles power, don't we, folks? And that lovely cross contour on all of these bodies. Even that 3D effect, folks. Remember, folks, we want the D word, not the D. Because D stands for dynamic, folks. And what is it? Dynamite plus microphone. Dynamic. But where's the dynamic come from? Well, I'll tell you. next time on Dragon Ball Z. Anyways, folks, now it's time for some free drawing. It's going to be fun because my memories of a goldfish like uh, our Mr. Lovely Graham Cracker Spine Sam over here. 
All right, folks. And see him maybe someday. But yes, sir. That is. Uh, those were my last five. Last five gesture drawings for a challenge I was proposed by the lovely Bargon Spaceman. Folks, make sure to check him out on uh, his stream. Usually on weekdays, sometimes unannounced. Yes, that's right, folks. Um, yep. Uh, I know that if I showed you any of my reference pictures, which can be found at the lovely onairvideo.com, also can, you can search it on uh, Croquis Cafe. Uh, I will get banned immediately, <laughs> which is utterly fantastic, folks. Love Twitch. Love Twitch. Anyways, folks, um, I guess now is time for some um, some fun character designs. Currently working on two comics right now, folks. One that's uh, past due. Need some. Uh, Flavor some love, otherwise known as uh, work and effort. Where's the recycling bin? The recycling bin audience is right here, oh, cool. right next to my other bin of recycle, also known as my dignity, folks. Found somewhere between. Depression and last week's late assignment. Last week's dinner, last week's dinner was. Oh, dude, if you want to look for last week's dinner, oh, you just missed out, my friend. It's, in it, the sewer. it's not in the sewer, it's in, your other it's in my hair. Keeps it greasy. Okay. Anyways, folks. As you can tell, late night streams are super zany, super fantastic, and I don't know what I'm doing. Art is not the best, comedy is not the best, but at least you're here, folks. That's what keeps us up at night. Give us some time to sleep, folks. Anyways, that was the inner me. I need to calm down. Let's do some fun drawings, folks. And yeah, I don't know what I'm drawing. You can see my horrendous character design. See, oh my goodness. That is a line. And I said I didn't do undo. Ha! Ha! Hypocrite. Ha 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 ha. You saw nothing. I clicked undo. Or did I? Huh? Huh? What? Oh. You got proof, studio audience? Oh, studio audience look at me like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. They sniff in my monitor. I think it's time for ASMR. <sighs> Did you enjoy that studio audience? This is going to be a very good VOD. I can already tell. Studio audience, can you feel that bi audio bi nautical <laughs> nonsense? I love this. Audio ness 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 ness. It's time to stop talking, says the audience. They're raising their salt banners. They're all oh, okay, okay. They're they're threatening me with some uh, red red dye, red marker. Ooh, they're gonna paint me orange. They're looking at me strange. They think I like it. They think, they think I like it. Oh, 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 oh. Studio audience is taking over. This is Rebel Radio. I have been orangeified. Dude, this is red. Why do they call them redheads if their hair is orange? No one knows. I remember that one time studio audience is reminding me. 
that one time I was tapped with a red marker and I thought I was bleeding. I saw my life flash before my eyes. Studio audience, have you had that experience before? Uh, maybe. They said maybe. But in fact, they were the perpetrators of said action that caused me great trauma. Momentarily. You know, like those paper cuts that you don't feel until you look at it. I felt the same thing, except I didn't feel it. I imagined the pain. Because uh, it was red marker. Red marker does not kill people unless it kills people. In which case, I'm wrong. So, the audience, live audience, make sure to get me on track, folks. Love you. Yes, remember folks, this is just some monkey in samurai armor. That was some owl. For I am a monkey. And I will not impersonate a monkey. It is not time for that. It's not it's not monkey business right now. It's not monkey business not right now, folks. I remember. Now, pen on paper demands the audience, right? Pen on paper. Let's draw some. It's not an actual pen that's not an actual paper. What happens when you put a pen that is? You're in trouble. Yeah, exactly. Funny joke. Ha ha. I've been watching quite a lot of Game Grumps. Fantastic show. I love it. I watch it every day religiously. Remember, folks, you too can be a part of the Game Grumps cult. I mean, fandom. Fandom. If you want to join a cult, join the Church of Yotsuba. They're still working on a website, but Church of Yotsuba. Worship the Yotsuba. Yotsuba is life. Anyways, folks. Too much memeing. Too much memeing. Not enough meaning. Too much memeing. Not enough meaning, folks. Ah, yes. Time to draw some derpy characters first. This is me on a good day. I know, lovely, right? I'm a Heckin Chonker, as they describe it in the biblical text of the interwebs, as they're called, the hyperspeed network railway. Gotta pull out your Ethernet cables, folks. Oh, oh, oh! What is he doing? What is he? What was? What's this? What's this guy doing? Got, he's got funny looking legs. In fact, he doesn't even have shoes. What a barbarian. Barbarians, even barbarians need shoes. See? Is it too hard for a barbarian to get shoes? Ooh, different sizes? Even better, folks. Oh, oh, what's this? Oh. Still not the same size. Church of Yotsuba, I see. Yotsuba is life, folks.
Yes, folks. Yes, folks. Alright. I have hair, folks. It's just the same color as my skin. I dare say. Yep. And of course, I need to make sure I have my monocle of justice. And my white knight fedora, as they call it. But apparently I drew a fez instead. Okay, that's okay, folks. That's okay. No harm, no foul. No harm, no foul. And what's at that time, folks? What's that time? It's, 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 it's pizza time. It's always pizza time. Pizza, pizza. I had a friend. I have a friend. Best, best pizza maker I know. No, pizza, pizza. All the time, pizza, pizza. You might be wondering why I cross my Z's and dot my I's. So I've crossed my T's and dot my pies. Well, folks, it's always pizza time where I am. Now let's get serious, folks. Let's try. Let's try hard, folks. For the stream. Not every day I get a stream. Not every day, folks. Not every day. We call this sketch. It's not because it's sketchy. Sketch one. I like this. Super six. Seventeen, folks. Average day's date, 17th of December. All right, folks, 1937. I don't know what happened that year. Probably nothing good. I mean, after all, it's 37. <clears throat> that was something good for someone. Hopefully. Out likely. Eh. Let's draw some anime girls. Yes, folks. I am, in fact, not a weeb. I cannot claim that title. That is a elite class of internet keyboard warriors. The anime fan club. I will not declare myself a weeb. For I am not worthy. Not worthy, folks. I am just a meager monkey in it, in samurai armor, folks. Ain't that right, Mike? Mike is getting, uh, getting some interference on his tinfoil hat, saying aliens are trying to take over the world, saying that they would destroy all humans. We will see to that, folks. We will see to that. Let's try some. I actually have a hard time drawing anime girls from the front view. It's actually remarkably difficult for me. It's been uh, been quite a while. Quite a while, folks. I did do a 50 head challenge. That was a quite a that was an old stream, folks. Old stream. Old. Old stream, old dreams. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, folks. Let's try to give this character some life. Doing this from memory, folks. Not gonna be pretty. But gonna be pretty good, I dare say. Not really, folks. It's uh, turning out to be a lot of trouble. Getting a little trouble here, getting some interference from the our, uh, alien overlords from Krypton. What is that? That's where Superman's from? Okay. Well, why do I need to know this? My producer is saying, uh, 
Be careful what you say. Because they might zap my brain. Microwave it. What do you think, studio audience? Okay, studio audience is all hypnotized, folks. They're all dead silent. Falling asleep. Well, folks, this might be the end of the show. End of the show. We must complete the enemy girl. She got to have them beautiful eyes. Beautiful eyes. Baby. She pretty girl. She pretty girl. Pen too thick. Pen too thick, I dare say. I like girls with kind faces. I like girls with kind of faces. Yep. I wish I could see that her neck is super thick. She must be, uh, oh no, oh no. Her proportions are off, folks. Gotta draw some hair, hide all the mistakes. That's how I do it, folks. That's how I do it. Gotta hide it under layers upon layers of hair, folks. You know what I mean, folks? I know if you've done something like this, you've always uh, used the magic of hair strands to make your characters dynamic. Hide all the mistakes, folks, and then they look cute as a cucumber. Or is that cute? Or is that cool? A cucumber. I do not know. My producer is saying we're running out of time tonight, folks. Running out of time. Gotta say that this cutie needs some Mark Crilly blushies. Ooh, that looks like raindrops on her face, folks. with this cutie. The alien overlords have wiped out the studio audience. They're doing funny dances, folks. We're all going to get destroyed. In fact, destroyed all humans. Oh. <laughs> the audience has decayed into lovely good nights. Good night, lovely audience, for they have hypnotized and brainwashed you. For all total of three people watching this, be aware, there's only one of you, so I don't know who the other ones are. <clears throat> one of you is a lie. One of you is real. And one of you is the true star of this show. Come out, reach for the stars, and buy candy bars, folks. And I'm sure if I spun her around, she'll look as goofy as a cucumber in a salad dressing. Yes, folks. I love me some schoolgirl uniforms. I'm too lazy to draw them right now, folks. So this is going to be a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful lady. That wouldn't go there. It would go here. Yep, folks. In fact, if we take take that line, it would go somewhere around here, folks. So, you know, you folks be the judge of this. You are... Eye of the storm. You will determine it all, folks. Determine how good this is, how bad it is. You are the masters of my domain. Ooh, I love this um 
Thoughts of eyes. So, folks, enough talking. Time to start sleeping. Thank you for joining the show tonight, folks. This is the Samurai Who. Signing off. Do some goofy drawings. Gotta put some timestamp on this, folks. And have a nice, nice evening, morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are, whenever you're watching this. Thank you for joining, folks. Remember, have a nice day and keep on drawing. Talk to you later, folks. See ya.